Hello, so right now we're about to make some homemade fresh pasta. We're going to make lasagna noodles because we're going to be making lasagna. I'll link it after this video. Um, first what I'm going to do is get a really big stock pot and fill it with water and start it boiling. And then we're going to go ahead and mix our flour, salt, and egg to make the noodles. I'll show you how that goes. Alright, first what we do is we take two and a half cups of flour. And then we're going to make a mountain in the middle. I think now I'm going to salt first. I don't know how much salt is in this salt. About a quarter <laughs> teaspoon of salt, maybe. Where's that quarter? Yeah. The other. Over here. Thank you. I'm going to order. I'm going to add like about a quarter teaspoon of salt on yours too. I miss doing cooking lessons, Mom. I'm about to start doing that again. Okay, we make a well in the middle, and then we're going to take four eggs that are room temperature. Well, yours is good, Dad. I, uh, <laughs> I was like, my mouth. Do not try to crack it on your mountain. <laughs> Inside of it? That's cool, Mom. And that's what the forks are for, by the way. We're going to whip. We're going to whip our eggs in it. And then you slowly whip flour into it and kind of turn it in. Does that make sense? And try not to let your mountain spill over before you're done. It's supposed to be collapsing into it. Ah. Ah, no! It spilled out of my mountain. <gasps> Grab it! <laughs> the mountain is moving. Mom, look at It's like the end of the world. Yeah, Mom, oh. too. Now it's an ocean. With it, an island thing. Yes. It's a big dome. There was a flood. It was a yeah. dam. The dam collapsed. We fixed the dam in a hurry. Yeah, in a very quick part. <laughs> Good thing we weren't doing this on the counter. Okay. <laughs> the whip is helpful. Uh, oh, there's too much in it right now. Well, it's getting to the point where we have to switch. When it gets difficult to do it with your fork, you do it with your yeah, hands. You do it with your hands. Swish it. That was insane. I had a dam break. <laughs> Work the dough for about five minutes, then you let it rest for 20 minutes. We'll cover it with plastic while it rests so it doesn't dry out. Oh boy. It's been a while since I made noodles, but I do remember they like to stick to things if you don't flour them well. And you're gonna wonder what you've done wrong. But if at first you don't succeed, try, try again, because homemade noodles are delicious. Okay, so squish it, kind of flat and fold it. We're trying to make it gain a little bit of elastic because we have to make better noodles. So fold it in half again? Yeah, fold it in half and squish it. Squish it. Now, you kind of run it through the flour after running it through the pasta machine. We just did it setting one for each of these. We're going to need a knife because we're going to need to shorten these babies out.
<laughs> All right. I'm just trying to show you the view of it going in here. I don't even know if this camera has sound, but we'll find out. Thank you, dude. Place them in the hot boiling water for about 30 seconds. You don't want them to stick together, so don't put too many. And then you dip them in icy water, which I have right next to here. Dip them in there. them out on a towel. Now we'll lay them out on a clean towel. I'm not going to film all the noodles because it's kind of hard to move the camera around. But you see what I'm doing here. Now they're cooked enough to put on your lasagna.